Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Radiant Historia. Today we have some, uh, side business to attend to. We're gonna try and do some story stuff, but there's a couple things I wanna do first. And first on our list is talking to Viola. <coughs> you don't look well. You should get some rest. You don't need to tell me. I get all the rest I can afford. By the way, I collected some materials for that book idea that you mentioned earlier. They're stories that the Prophet Noah told me. This... this is your personal journal. After much thought, I concluded that my journal was probably the most factual account. I lived my daily life alongside the Prophet Noah's words. So I think it would be best if you gave him my journal. It's quite detailed. Are you sure you don't mind this being public? It is perhaps as you say. But I want to believe in the people living, now, living in Alistel. I'll let you decide how best to use the journal. It's my personal diary, a one-of-a-kind resource, so use it wisely. Oh, we will. Side quests are important. Anywho. Speaking of side quests, let's go finish this one that we are just updating now. Where's my node? Here we are. Back to Historia. We're going to be going back a little ways. Where am I here? A new mission. Back in time we go. And let's just skip all this. Because that's how we do. Alright, we're back here. We got our dudes. dudes. Before we talk to... What's his face? I forget his name. Uh, we do want to go back here. And I think it's this room? That has our dude. Ah, it's you guys. How's it going? Been any scrolls lately? You want Rainier and Marco to learn it, anything new right now? Yeah. Let's teach something to Rainy. Ooh, you found a spear technique scroll. Thank you. In return, I'll teach you a special technique. Okay, here we go. Anytime you're ready. You did well. The move is now yours, brother. Yeah! Rainy learned resist boost. If you find another technique scroll, bring it back to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, let's see. Skill, Rainy. Oh, that won't show me, huh? Oh, there you go. Resist boost. Temporarily, resi uh, temporarily raises magic defense. I'm not sure how useful that'll be, but it's uh, ours now, so there's that. Now then, let's go talk to What's-His-Face and do our questy. Questy quest. Where are you? I think you were... Uh, no, wait. I think you were by the tavern, actually, if I remember right. Was it you? <coughs> I've been coughing a lot these days. Don't turn to sand, dude. I, I don't remember where I am. I told Ivan that he should be playing Lieutenant General Raoul. He really got mad, though. That's out of line, don't you think? That's so rude to the Lieutenant General. Wait, weren't you the one asking for the ring? I got the ring, didn't I? Or did I just ask about the ring? I can't remember. Okay, where in the hell is Cedric? Okay, wait, because that's the tavern, right? This is the tavern. Yes. He's... On the upper platform next to the tavern. Is it you? It is you. Oh, it's you. How about it, sir? May I ask you about Field Marshal Viola now? What should I do? I do have Viola's diary. I've skimmed it. Some of its contents are too sensitive for the public eye. Especially the parts concerning her health conditions. Should I give them the diary anyway? I have to think about this one carefully. Sh 
Should I keep Viola's diary hidden? I'm sorry, but you ought to forget what I said before. Uh, I see. No, don't apologize. I asked for the impossible. But you know what? I had the chance to speak with General Hugo. It's possible that he finally sees the worth of my work. I'm planning to visit him in the castle soon. General Hugo, please show us the way. The scion of the great prophet Noah. Long live General Hugo. Long live Alistair. That was the last Stock and Cedric ever saw of each other. No one knows what became of Cedric after he went to speak with Hugo. And there's no way of learning it now. Not even a year later, Noah and Viola were completely forgotten by the public. Alistair's attention had been stolen, the limelight occupied by an actor named Hugo. Noah's voice will never be heard. Viola's presence will never be brought to light. Alistair now descends into darkness. A voice unheard. Finn. Welcome back, Stock. I was disappointed to see what happened to Alistair. Now, generally, he will do nothing to prevent the world's destruction. And as this power grows... You must use the White Chronicle. Don't worry. I'm sure you can guide Alistair in the right direction. Should I really be showing Cedric Viola's diary? I did speak with her. In fact, I have her personal journal. Her own diary? Wow! Amazing! Please show me! I warn you, the contents will shock you. No, they will shock all of Alistair. You must promise that until the day you are required to release it, you will keep it a secret. It seems the intelligence within requires a certain resolve before I can face it. Alright, I swear it. In the name of the Prophet Noah, and of Field Marshal Viola. So this is Viola's diary. Wow. It contains the words of the Prophet Noah in... detail. I can't have this, can I? I'll have to copy it by hand. This may take some time to write down. Go ahead. I've got time. That's all of it. Thank you very much, sir. As promised, I won't release any of this until the time is right. This is a token of my appreciation. I don't have a use for it, but you might. Noah Amulet obtained. The event a letter to tomorrow has been revised. All right, Noah Amulet. What is that? That is an accessory. Poison sleep paralysis. Eh. I'm sure we have someone that doesn't have. Yeah, we'll, we'll give it to. Marco, because he's... You know, we'll give the Emerald to Marco, too, because he's really suffering without those things that uh, Rosh has. Anywho, uh, the reason why I paused there doing that text there is because my brother walked in and told me to keep it down, but I mean, I'm talking quieter than usual, actually, and no one's ever told me to quiet down before, so figured that one out. Anyway, we are going to... We are going to... A different node in history. We are actually... where is it? Uh, God, where are you? Uh, do I even have that one? Did I forget to go somewhere? I think I forgot to go somewhere. Ah, oh, damn it. Yep. Yeah. Crap. 
We are supposed to be over here on this timeline. I also got a lot of XP. Hey, Rosh got a level. Ooh, Rosh got a grapple. Okay, well, there's that. He wouldn't have gotten a level otherwise, because he wouldn't have been in our party. Uh, we've already seen this. We've already seen all these cutscenes, right? We've already seen this one. And this is how we got to chapter two. And we've seen this one. And we've seen this one. And this one. There we go. Back where we started the episode. Man, why don't I just start over? Nah. Okay, anyway. Uh, we gotta go to Grand Plain. We still got a bunch of stuff done. And we did cutscenes and all that sort of thing. I think we probably spent like 10 minutes retreading old ground, but I can cut that out. So, let us go up. What node are we even at? I want to know. Where are we? All cells offensive, yeah. Wait, no. Wait, could I have totally gone there? I thought it was like just a dead end. I'm bad. You know what? You totally could have... We totally didn't need to do that. I'm cutting all of that out. Oh my god. I'm stupid. I forgot. You can just travel straight to the chapter 2, can't you? Hello. Anyway... Well, that was a big waste of time for me, but I guess I'm just going to cut all of that out, because I'm stupid. What do you want to say? What do you say? Grand Plains beyond here. The Rosh Brigade is already there. They arrived from all mine. I'm not going to talk to the guy. Probably says something stupid. I'm pissed. I'm actually legit super pissed. Serious music is playing. Once we confirm their position and numbers, we'll move out. Until then, keep the prototype throw machines ready to go at a moment's notice. We're going to rendezvous with Rosh and his men on the west side of Grand Plain, right? I hope they haven't gone far. Ah, they'll be fine if the captain's with them. We should get going, too. Yeah. Battle of Grand Plain. Alistair's Offensive has begun in earnest, it seems. I guess that's why the note is called Alistair's Offensive. Oh, no. I, I think we've done enough BS. Don't need to do these fights for one episode, even though I guess you guys haven't seen them. I'm going to keep talking about how I edited a thing out. I don't even know how long that segment went on that I'm cutting out. It was probably, shit, like 10 minutes. Or 15. I don't know. It was like six minutes when we finished the, the Cedric thing, wasn't it? I can't remember. My time right now says 24 minutes, so figure that one out for yourselves. Oh, God. You know what? You know what? I'm just... I'm out of here. Later. I don't want to deal with this right now. Okay, I think we're supposed to go west now. Shit. Oh, that's a lot of attacks in a row. Ooh, God, don't hurt me too bad, please. And I'm poisoned. Oh, that's just, this is all going to get better. This is so good. I love what's happening right now. Oh, my God. Jeez. Oh, holy crap. So one of you guys has to get away, right? Please, Randy, get away. Okay. Jeez, that hurt. That hurt everything. Good enough. At least we're not poisoned still. I don't remember where we're going. Just cutscene, I guess. What the hell are those? Gregorian soldiers? Enemy soldiers dead ahead. We'll break through there. 
We can't. Our mission was to... If we don't go through there, we can't get to the west side. Well, that's true. Alright, I'll cover you. See that you do. What? We're under attack! Wait, you're not part of the advanced troop. Don't sweat it, man. Between this and the ones from earlier, it seems our forces are being underestimated. We'll show you what a mistake that is. I guess that means we lost some troops, huh? Alright, no biggie. Can order defender in a nice big cross shape. Well... Hmm. I forgot stock had resurrection magic. I guess we'll just get some... hits on this guy. Okay, so they don't have too much HP. Probably around 300. Ooh, power up. Kinda wish you had done that on yourself so you would die faster. But beggars can't be choosers. I doubt they're weak to any specific kind of magic, so I'm just gonna hit them with whatever I feel like. Oh, you're powering up everybody. I don't like that. Please don't do that. Magic boost. We'll do stock, because he can do fire. Pick a dude. This guy's the least HP. And he's almost dead. If only I'd focused my efforts. Ow. Don't hit Rainy. Thank you. Okay. Fire, we'll just kill you. Magic boost. Rainy. And we'll have you... You probably heal for crap, so we'll just give Rainy some items. Unlike some other Let's Players, <coughs> no, <I'll come coughs> I have no qualms with using items. That said, I, and I don't mean to say that he's wrong for not using items. I know some people will get that in their head somehow. Uh, that said, I am an item hoarder, and I generally don't use them unless I'm just too lazy to spend it. MP. Unless that MP is, like, super precious. Then I'll use a lot of items, too. Uh-oh. Well, thankfully it's an easy way to knock them out of that form. Which is just to knock them out of position. Stop that! You're an asshole. And I hate you forever. Okay. Uh, well, good thing Marco has push assault. I mean, right assault now. Getting those squirrels is useful after all. Do not go back in position. I hate you so much. Okay. Anyway. Right assault. Yeah, whatever. Fire. And another fire. And these guys should be dead. Like, super, super dead, yep. Fire's so good. Well, just magic in general. Oh my god. Go to hell. Oh, you almost died. I'm sad that you didn't die, actually. Rainy's living. Let's give Marco the last shot. I mean, Stock's not going to have it, but Marco did the killing blow. That's all that matters. Oh, and Stock learned weakness scan. How quaint. That's our Stock. I feel much better knowing you've got my back. Indeed. I always breathe easier when I'm fighting alongside you, Stock. The same goes for you, too. Well, this took much longer than I thought. We need to pick up the pace. As a consequence of having to cut stuff out, by the way, which is just another reason why I like don't like doing it, is I have no idea how long we've been going for, so I'm trying to keep going. If this just turns out... If this turns out to be a long episode, you know why. Should I heal... or save, I mean? I think I'm okay. We'll just have Marco heal us up. I don't have Rosh with me, because he's in the other thing, so... Oop. Get out of here. Uh, this way... Looks to be the right way. This is too, too Grinorga. 
We need to hurry and find Arash. Yeah, so that's not the way we want to go. Ah, uh, I, yeah, no. Even though I just passed it, I forgot what the geometry actually was there. Escape, and we should get away. We should get away. There we go. Let's go west. Man, you guys got set up. What the fuck? What did I get into a battle with? What? I am confused. What did I get into a battle with? That guy, what? Or was I just getting into a battle with that front line with the barricades? I can't see Rosh anywhere. You're from Rosh's brigade. What happened? Uh, Sergeant, thank goodness. Hurry, the captain and the others. Save them. Hang in there. Mark, don't just stand there. Heal him. What are you waiting for? Hurry! It's no use, Rainy. He's already dead. Lieutenant Stock, I have a message for you. What's happened? Report from Field Marshal Viola. Grinorg's army has arrived. The enemy's numbers are great, and they may be able to break through our lines. No. I must return to my post now. Please excuse me. What should we do, Stock? It's the best course of action. If we don't hold the north, this is a losing battle. But doing that would mean leaving Rosh and his men behind. I have to think about this one carefully. Should I really head north and strike preemptively at the enemy reinforcements? I'm worried about Rosh too, but we need to concentrate on winning this battle. We'll head north and join up with the main force. We'll have to drive back Renork's knights. Okay, understood. With emotions running high, Stock and the others rush through the battlefield. After joining up with Viola, Stock fought furiously at the heart of the struggle. His efforts resulted in Alstel gaining control over the Grand Plain. The battle did much to elevate Field Marshal Viola's standing in the kingdom. She became a powerful voice of authority, equal to that of General Hugo. But Stock and the others paid a terrible price for their victory. Rosh never saw his home again. Stock was requested to fill Rosh's shoes as a commanding officer. He would come to be known as the Lion General. But his new slate of duties left Stock with no means to stop the world's desert desertification. The Lion General. Finn. You've returned, Stock. You made the best decision you could, as a military man. But Destiny thought otherwise. Your choice didn't do enough to avert the world's end. Your position as a commander took priority in this case. And the people who were key to saving the world died in battle. The world still needs Rosh. And you do too. Stock, protect him. I think it's more important that we rendezvous with Rosh. It is, isn't it? We'll find Rosh's brigade and rendezvous with him per the original plan. There's not much time. We need to hurry. You're right. Let's go, Stock. Hmm. You hear something from over there? Rosh is in danger. Let's go. That's... Q. 
Count Selvin's information was right on the money. I didn't think a whole brigade would go down this easy. D damn it. Huh? You're still alive. Well, don't think we're going to take you as a hostage. Our contract with the man was very specific. Prove to me he's dead by bringing me his head. Farewell. Have fun with your men in the next life. Stop right there. What? There were survivors? Rosh. Kill. Damn it. I'm coming to save you. Look at you guys in your barricades. You're cute. I'm not sure if we can hurt these guys as long as these barricades are up. We're gonna give it a shot, though. Oh, they take magic damage pretty good. Maybe we just can't melee them. Or maybe they're getting a defense boost. Probably getting a defense boost. How about we burn the shit out of these things? Nah. I had a feeling. Fire's pretty good. Now let's see, what can I do? Well, we'll just magic boost Rainy. We'll use Stock's fire in order to destroy the shields and Rainy's in order to kill them. Sounds like a plan to me. Good thing Stock can one-shot it too. I was gonna be sad if my plan something fell through because you can't kill it in one go. Oh well. Okay, uh, fire. Let's murder you. You're not gonna die though. Almost will. I'm not sure if Rainy will two-shot people. She'll almost two-shot people. Uh... I don't... Hmm. Marco just doesn't do damage. So I can't have him just finish off that soldier. Which is annoying. Let's do a power wave and kill this guy. Takes more MP than fire, but I just feel like changing it up. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Rainy, Fire, Blue Gnoric Soldier. As usual, we will focus on one of them at a time. Eh, we'll burn this. Just so I can save on healing turns. We can use Marco's turns to get some uh, combos going. Should I burn it or just finish? Let's burn it. It's like... See, he did 90 to the shield before, and now he's doing 120, so that's a 30% damage increase. It's not bad. Fire's pretty good, huh? Uh, like I said, we'll use this time to set up some combos. Fire, and fire. Too bad we don't have a physical attack buff, or else I just put that on stock all the time. Ooh, kill him. That one dude only took two shots, didn't he? He only took one fire from Stock and one from Rainy. That top guy? Hmm. Cool. Okay, uh, we'll see. We'll spend some time firing you. Do you have, like, a defense down or something? No, you have a defense up. We will spend some time... Or one turn putting fire on this guy just to see how weak he is. Ouch. Uh, I don't know, I was going to say we could just poison break him, but I think we can just kill him now, so. And goodbye. Let's just get for hurting Raj. Dickbag. <sighs> hey, hang in there. Stock. I'm sorry. Rosh, don't. Sergeant, help. <sighs> what can I do? How can I save them? Do I change what happened here? But how? Or... Can this moment in history not be changed? What's this?
It seems the plan was to lure Rosh's brigade here all along. Wait. If I have their plans documented like this, maybe I can tell someone that Rosh's brigade is in danger, and we can move out earlier. Then we can get here before it's too late. Rush. Kill. Wait for me. I'll find a way to save you. It looks like you didn't make it in time to rendezvous with them. It would appear your movements were known to the enemy. What will you do now, Stock? I lifted this document off one of them. If I give it to the commander, that should do it. I see. You hope to use their knowledge of your movements to your advantage this time. That's right. Very well. We'll leave the rest to you. I think we'll end it here, because we've got some stuff happening next time. So, thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it for the most part, except for that one part where I have to cut out, because I'm stupid. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye! Actually, I could have taken all that stuff off of Rosh before I did this fight, huh? Well, there goes that idea. Okay. Let's do right assault, change, you, skill. I had Rosh for this fight last time, right? So I guess we can show you how to do it with Marco. Skill. Yeah, we'll just use some fire. Just burn him. I didn't do that much damage. I feel like I should have done more. Ooh, we're almost... We almost have a mana break. So we could potentially go... Kill that boar now. I'm down for that. Maybe we'll do that next episode or something, though. I want to try and get some other stuff done first. Okay, we'll burn you. And magic boost. Rosh. Not Rosh. Stock. Man. Ooh, the deeps. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Uh. Get up, Rainy. That was a lot of damage. Uh oh. I sense a problemo. I can't delete. Oh, you don't have a thing ready yet. Okay, uh, you have right assault. So we can at least get you off the panel, which is what I need. The other guy's gonna hurt, but... Ooh. No! Asshole. It's gonna delete her panel, too. So even if I revive her, which I'm going to do, she's not gonna have a turn. Yeah, there she is. Okay. I guess we'll just push them again, and hopefully they don't kill Rainy this time. Oh, Rainy, why? Thank God. Okay. Fire, get off my cloud. Please die, thank you. And you didn't die. They're all going for you. I need to heal. Let's do that. That'll work well enough for now. Whoa! How come he only took... Okay, wait a minute. How come Marco only took like 50 damage, but Rainy takes 150? That's crap, man. Okay. Change with you, skill, grapple. 
Actually, no. Right Assault. I want to get rid of all these archers before I even think about attacking that dude. At least there's no power zone to worry about anymore. So I don't even have to worry about healing, because they're not going to kill me. Change with Marco. I don't think Rainy has her buff anymore, which is going to be a problem. I mean, I'm pretty sure that she doesn't have her buff anymore, because she died. But still. Okay, now both of you should be dead. Good. Good, 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 good. Now we'll just do a power wave. Oh wait, you have a defense buff. Never mind. That was a bad idea. Don't do what I do, kids. Learn from my mistakes. Why don't we just change and have Marco magic buff first? How about that? Sorry we have to retread old ground like this. Maybe we'll cut the fight out. Seems fair. Or maybe I'll leave it in. Maybe I'll just forget entirely. Sounds like a thing I'll do. Get ticked on! I don't even care. I'll heal after. Kill him. Guard, hope you're fine. Dead.